Hi, this is Marauders here with the Acer W510. So today we're gonna have a look at the video performance, playback performance of the Acer W510. And in general, we will see how well the Intel Clover Trail is at performing video playback. And let's see. We'll first start off with one of the more common scenarios that people will ask which is Is it able to watch HD YouTube videos? So here I have a 1080 YouTube clip If we come in here, you can see that Regardless of the quality, this thing, the raw video is at 1080 resolution right now So you can see that it's playing and uh, it's playing smoothly, there aren't any jerks or lags. Now I'll just switch over to the full screen mode. And you can see it's still playing without any problems. So in when you're dealing with YouTube videos at 1080p, there shouldn't be any issue. And you Again, the Clover Trail is um, surprisingly adept where it can perform pretty well in video rendering. But I guess this could be because of the hardware acceleration which is offered by the Flash plugin as well as IE10. And we'll move over to the next test. Now here we have a 1080 video clip. So once again, I go to full screen and you can see that again there is plenty of any issues and to prove that it is a 1080 video obviously when you're trying to multitask on it it will have a bit of a slowdown it is still at only an atom so here we have that on the video video information it is of a 1080p resolution so no issues with 1080p viewing if you are a viewer of an anime video you might have come across this term known as high 10p high 10p is essentially a higher quality profile of the H.264 video codec. The qu output quality is much better but at the same time the decoding the requirements on decoding the video is actually much higher so you need, usually need a high powered machine to decode it. But here what we have here is a high temp video at 720p resolution Let's switch over to the media info so you can see this is a high 10p video and you can see that it is playing it very smoothly so as a media tablet the W510 is actually quite capable and uh, the performance is quite surprising. In the end, how well a video plays has, uh, has less to do with what codec it uses and what codec or resolution it uses and actually has more to do with the processing bitrate of the video. For example, here we have a video, a 1080 video so you can see that it's 1080 and it is a high 10p file it is a high 10p file and it is actually playing very well now if we look at the video bitrate the bitrate of the actual data being processed you can see that normally it's actually pretty steady because there's not much due to encoding parameters, there's not much happening on screen and thus the bitrate is actually quite low at 400 kbps 
but if there were a lot of things happening on screen for example during an anime's uh, notorious uh, opening sequence and we can see that the video is starting to break up because the bitrate that needs to be processed itself is also increasing So you, the you'll be okay with videos that have a normal, normal flow during uh, in in any normal sense of a picture, but if you have a lot of uh, moving, if the scene changes rapidly, and if there's a noise in the picture, well, those are all things that contribute to a high bit rate. And of course, the Atom isn't going to be able to keep up. But in general, it, they, you should be fine watching most of most videos. So there you have it, the Acer W510 or Intel Clover Trail. Surprisingly effective at uh, playing HD videos, because. I myself was totally not expecting this to happen on an Atom that is capable of playing 1080p and of course at high 10p as well uh, but even though it seems quite capable at playing video there are some quirks and problems with video performance in general so we will get into that in my next video update see you around